Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. This is BJ Tutor, and in this video, let us try to solve exercise 11.4, question number 3. Hello everyone, so in this video, let us try to solve our question number 3. So the first question says, given Munus as to be x years, can you guess what x minus 2 may show? And they have given us the hint. It says, think of Munu's younger brother. Okay, so then, so here, they have given the name of a person. And the name of a person is Munu's. And his age is X years. <coughs> okay, the age of Munu is X years. And the question is asking us to find can you guess what x minus 2 may show? So whose s will this x minus 2 will be? Okay, and they have given us a hint to think of Monu's younger brother. So since in the given question they have used minus sign, so it means that Monu's younger brother is, is 2 years younger. Okay, so x minus 2 will be Munu's younger brother. Munu's younger brother's is right? Munu's younger brother's is And since they have used minus sign here, it means that Munu's younger brother is two year, two years less than Munu. Understood, student? So this will be the age of Munu's younger brother. And Munu's younger brother's age will be two years younger than Munu. Now we have two more expressions. <coughs> we have two more expressions. That it says, can you guess what x plus 4 may show? So the question is asking our next expression as x plus 4. <coughs> Understood? So then, and here, we can think of any other person related to Munu. <coughs> we may think about his uncle or his elder brother or his father or his mother. We can think of any other person. So here x plus 4. And here we have you they have given us the plus sign, right? So x plus 4 will be someone who is elder than Munus. Right? Because that person will be four years more than Munu, since they have used plus sign. So we can think at it as Munu's elder brother, right? Munu's elder <coughs> brothers. So this will be the age of Munu's elder brother. And his age is four years more than Munu's. Understood? So then we have one more expression. Now we have one more expression. And the expression is 3x plus 7, right? So we have to find whose s will this be? 3x plus 7. So first of all, what does 3x indicates? It indicates that this person is, is 3 times the s of Munu. And it is also 7 years, 7 years more. Since it says plus 7, right? So let this s be the s of Munu's father. Munu's. Munu's father. <coughs> so Munu's father's is. So Munu's father is is seven years more, right? Since it says plus, so seven years more than three times the age of Munu. Understood? So then, so first of all, we have x minus two. Since it has minus sign, this will be age of Munu's younger brother. And his age is 2 years younger than Munu. Next, we have x plus 4. So, since there is a plus sign, we think it as Munu's elder brother, right? So, Munu's elder brother is 4 years more than Munu. And the last one, we have <coughs> 3x plus 7. And we, we take this as to be the age of Munu's father. And Munu's father's age is... 7 years more than 3 times 
the ace of Munu. Understood? So let's write the answer. So first of all, the given expression is x minus 2, right? So we have to write what does x minus 2 indicates. So x minus 2 shows the ace of <coughs> Munu's younger brother. Munu's <coughs> younger <coughs> brother. Whose ace is whose ace is <coughs> so here there is a minus sign, right? So the Munu's younger brother will be minus two. So Munu's younger brother ace will be two years younger. Whose ace is two years younger than Munu? <coughs> Understood, student? Next, we have our next expression is x plus 4. x plus 4. So, x plus 4 shows the ace of the ace of whose? Munu's Munu's elder brother, right? Elder brother. Whose ace is Whose ace is, so here in this expression, we can see that there is a plus sign. So, Munu's elder brother ace will be four years more, right? Four years more than Munu. <coughs> Understood, so then, next we have one more expression. And our last expression is 3x plus 7 right 3x plus 7 so we take this 3x plus 7 as the ace of Munu's father right so 3x plus 7 shows the ace of Munu's father <coughs> whose ace is whose ace is so here it says plus 7, right? So it means that it will be 7 years more. 7 years more <coughs> than, next it says 3x, right? So 3 times, 3 times the ace of, and we all know that this x is the ace of Munu, right? So 3 times the ace of Munu. <clears throat> and so then let's read our next question next to then we have question number b and it says given Sarah's ace today to be y years think of her ace in the future or in the past what will be the following expressions indicate and they have given us some expressions okay so, in the question, they have given us the name of a person. And that person's name is Sarah. And the ace of Sarah, the present ace of Sarah is given to be Y years. Understood? And the question further says, think of her ace. Her means our girl Sarah. So, think of her ace in the future or in the past. And what will be the following expression? Indicate. So let's look at the first expression. They have given the first expression as y plus 7. <clears throat> so we are going to find whether this expression will be the ace of Sarah's in the future or in the past. Understood, student? And we can see from this expression that there is a plus sign. So it means that this will be the ace of Sarah's. In the future, Sarah's future ace. Okay, and next expression is so this will be Sarah's future ace. Next expression is y minus 3. So since there is a minus sign, it indicates Sarah's past ace. Right? Next it says y plus 4 and a half. So there's a plus sign. 
So indicate Sarah's future age. And last we have y minus two and a half. So since there's a minus sign, this expression indicates Sarah's past age. So student, but we cannot simply write future past, future past. We have to explain it. So the expression y plus seven indicates Sarah's future age, right? So how would you write this in answer? It's very simple. We will write y plus seven indicates Sarah's future age seven years from now. Understood? And here the minus sign, right? So we will write y minus 3 indicates Sarah's past is 3 years ago. Understood? So like that, we have to write the sentence. So let's write. So let's, let's write the answer. Our first expression is y plus 7, right? So y plus 7 shows Sarah's future is. Sarah's future is seven years from now right seven years from now it's very simple next our next expression is y minus three right so since there is a minus sign it will show sarah's shows sarah's past is right since there is a minus sign there it will show sarah's past is three years Instead of from now, it will be three years ago. Right, so then, next, our next expression is y plus, y plus four and a half. <coughs> so, it will show Sarah's, so since there is a plus sign, it will show Sarah's future is, right? Future is four and a half years from now years from now right and we have one more expression our last expression we have one more expression and that is y minus two and a half y minus two and a half and what does y minus two and a half so it shows Sarah's so since there is a minus sign it will show Sarah's past is right past is two and a half years ago and so then that's it it's very simple so that's it for this video I hope you all understood all the answer for this questions I will see you all in the next video stay home stay safe everyone please do take care